Hi guys! I don't know what's going on with my soft video, but apparently a very soft video. Um, happy Sunday, happy Father's Day to whoever's watching who has a father or um, who is a father. Ooh, that's weird. Okay, um, sorry, I'm not sure what's going on my phone right now. This is so weird. Okay, there we go. Anyways, review time. Um, I guess I'm just saying I'm mood lighting with this little fuzzy video. <laughs> Alright. The Golden Couple by Greer Hendricks and Sarah Pekinen. Um, I love these authors. This is their newest book. Um, and I'm giving it four and a half stars. So, Greer and Sarah write a lot of thrillers. Um, I fell in love with them since The Wife Between Us. I think there's one book I haven't finished yet, which is Anonymous Girl, but hopefully I'll get that done this year. So I'm caught up. Anyways, so The Golden Couple is about a golden couple. Um, basically, it's a couple. So we have two different story or two different um, point of views. Avery, who is the um, therapist, and Marissa, who is the wife, who's going to her about their marriage. So Marissa and Matthew um, go to see Avery, and Marissa says that she cheated on Matthew. And he gets, you know, upset and that they're going to her to work on their marriage. So, Avery has her own issues. Um, she's being stalked by his company because uh, she helped this whistleblower to um, call them out. And now the company's going after her to try out who, who the whistleblower is. So she has her own set of problems. And then she has to deal with this couple. It's not that... It's just the weird stuff that happens with this couple she's dealing with. There's so many outside variances. It's crazy. Um, so, for mostly like 80% of the book, you just go along going, okay. You know, there's her, the, co or the girl who works for Polly who's trying to look like Marissa. There's their friend Skip, who Marissa slept with. Um... There's the Natalie girl who Marissa thinks loves her husband. And it's just crazy. Like all these outside forces. And weird notes are popping up. No, everything. So weird things are happening. Okay. 80% is like that. The last 20% is where it gets really good. So I figured out one thing out of all the many twists and surprises. Only one thing. So yes, I was pleasantly surprised um, by everything that came to fruition. Ooh, I like that word, fruition. Um, I gave it an extra half star because I was a little teary-eyed at the end. Not in a bad way. But, you know. I think it was like, kind of like teary going, I'm, I'm finally glad something was resolved. And it was a very good ending. I, I love the ending. It was great, so... I'm trying to do this without giving any spoilers. <laughs> so all in all, it was a good thriller. It kept me on the edge of my seat in the last 20%. So like, you know, I'm reading it chapter by chapter. I'm like, okay, okay. And I'm waiting for the twist to come. And the last 20%, the twist came. So I'm like, okay, I got to finish it. And I finished it last night. So all in all, a great book. So if you've read them before, I highly recommend it. If you haven't read it, if you want to start with this one and then go back and read the other books, do whatever you want to do. Or if you don't, that's fine by me too. Alright, so again, that was The Golden Couple. I love the cover with the golden rose. By Gru Hendricks and Sarah Pekinen. And I'm giving this four and a half stars. Alright, so that's it for me today. Um, hopefully everyone has, is having a great weekend. This is the beginning of mine. I'm off for the next two days after this. So, yay! Hopefully finish more books and do more reviews. And hopefully I can figure out this fuzzy stuff around my video. Who the heck knows? Alright guys, I'll see you later and happy reading. Bye!